Good morning. This is Val with This Is How You Do It. And I am um, taking down my twists. What I did was I plaited all my hair in this size twist last night, all in the back, on the side. I took these to loose already to exp expedite the video. But I want to um, show you what I use to lay down my edges. I usually use the edge control or some gel, but I have told people they can use this grease. You know how you, your husband's hair, oh my goodness, I just dropped it. Well, how your husband's hair, this Murray grease or wax. Now, you can use this same wax and look how much you get. And uh, lay down your edges. I have mentioned that before, but I never did a video showing how it works. Now I'm I'm do, I'm laying my edges down with Murray um grease or wax. See it? This is Murray on dry hair. When you do it on wet hair, you know how it has to film the same way you do when you have the edge control, but it'll still do the same thing. But I have said in in my earlier earlier videos when I first started that you can use the Murray grease to lay down your edges. I don't know if it's cheap or anything because I don't know. I I didn't had this Murray grease for a long time, way before I started um with the Curly Girl method. And I started the Curly Girl method. This is my ninth. I'm in mean my tenth month with the Curly Girl method, and I still have this grease. And I used the edge control, and I used all my edge control up, but this Murray grease grease is still sitting in the bathroom. And I just want to show you how I lay the edges down. You can use Murray grease or wax to lay your edges down. And we as women, it may last us a little longer because it's such a large amount. Okay. Now I'm going to finish taking my uh, two strand twist down. These are not plaits. This is my two strand twist. I'm still trying to uh, see with my hair, how my hair looks with a two strand twist. I haven't given up on it. So uh, here we go. It does it, but I have a thin grade of hair. And like like I say, mine don't look like the girls on the videos. And that's my whole thing about it. I'm um I would like mine to look like theirs, but the thing is, I'm also showing that everything doesn't work for everybody and you have to uh tweak stuff that other people do and don't get discouraged. Just keep on trying. Don't get discouraged if yours is not exactly like the ones on on YouTube. Now I done, I done took all my twists down, hopefully covered my parts, and I have them rake my finger through it and comb through it. This is the way my uh, two strand twists look look like when I take them out. And I did not put the hoodie on because my hair being at this length, uh, my twists, you see how they turn up like that? They fold up when I put the uh, the hoodie on. So I slept. I did my two-strand twist early around about um, 6 or 7 o'clock that night. And then I let it air dry after the, uh, and, and after I let it air dry, I was thinking about it before I went to bed to put the cap on it. But I want to lay with the twist flat, you know, so they won't be sticking up like that in different places.
my back part did stick up you know it was hanging down like that when I twisted but then when I woke up it was folded you know in different places so and I tried to stretch them before I came on on t on uh on camera like pull them down like that but this is my two strand twist out and um this is the end of my video I just want to show you me show you when I take I taking it down See? and I did not make a makeup video today I may start back but we'll see alright thanks for watching and as always this is Valerie with this is how you do it don't forget to subscribe and I did when I asked you to uh, vote on that hairstyle with that Egyptian look I just want you to give me a thumbs up on the one you liked not a thumb down, not a thumb down on the one you don't like just a thumbs up on the one you like and then I will uh, know which one um, my audience cared about or felt that looked good on me alright people that's it and I'll talk to you later bye bye